Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be bringing you another awesome kids craft video. Everything you see in this video is excellent for children to do. It is well within their capabilities and skills and everything is totally customizable and they can just kind of have fun and do whatever they would like with all of these things and it will help them broaden their imagination and just have a lot of fun. So the first thing that we are doing is this little dot rainbow art and for this you will need obviously some paint and some paper. You'll also need something to paint with so anything you can find in your house. I am actually using a hot glue gun stick because it makes really really great circles but anything like a q-tip, a spoon, really anything in your house. You can even go outside and use leaves, pine cones, anything textured to make your art and you can do this every day this week and use something different and just kind of compare the textures but essentially your kid will just use whatever tool you gave them and kind of color make little dots just experiment with the colors the next thing we're making are these little egg carton turtles are they not adorable these are super easy and super fun and everybody in your house can make something different for this, you'll need some pipe cleaners, some pom-poms, paint brushes, egg cartons, some paint, some googly eyes, and of course we'll need a little bit of Elmer's glue. For this, the first thing you'll do is you'll just paint your egg carton the color that you want it. I've chosen green because that just reminds me of a turtle. And Madeline, of course, is doing pink and glittery. If that isn't her to a T, then I don't know what is. So what we've done is we've painted our egg carton and now we are going to glue the head on. It's just a pom-pom. You just glue it right onto the front. Then we are twisting around some pipe cleaners and these are going to be the little legs. So you just glue those in or you can even just punch them through the egg carton without glue if you don't have any glue. And we're just making these different sizes, trying to make them look as much like little flippers as we can. Now we're gluing on the eyes, which I'm not gonna lie guys, with the pom-poms we had, these were difficult. But here you go. Here's the end result. You can put on four legs, two legs, and a tail. Whatever your child wants, let them experiment with it. Remember, it doesn't have to be perfect. Next, we are doing these little fish. These are my absolute favorite. They have all of the exact same supplies as the turtle. You'll just need some type of tissue paper. You can even just use tissues, regular paper, whatever you can get that can kind of crumple up. So we're doing all of the exact same steps. We're painting this, I picked red, and of course, Madeline pinked glittery pink again. So I'm just painting mine red and that's because that's the only other color paper I had, but we are taking the paper and you just take a little clump and kind of fold it over and you'll just glue it to the underside of the egg carton. And this makes the fins and the tail. This can be any size you want. You can make them different sizes, different colors. Again, just let your child experiment. Let them have fun. Let them pick how they want this to look. Once we have attached all of our fins, we are going to attach the eyes. We have a couple different size eyes, so I used these really, really big ones for mine, and Madeline used a little bit smaller ones for hers. Something that you can do also is you can make little mouths on them. We just use pipe cleaners. You can always draw them on, use string, use whatever you want to add to the character of your fish. They have these cute little personalities, and you really can just Customize them however you want. Now for the next one, this is sand art. This is something that has been really super fun for us because it's sort of like doing a science experiment. It's really cool how the colors blend together and just how the whole thing works. So you can actually turn this into an educational lesson as well if you would like to. For this, you basically just need something to paint with. You need some paper. You need glue. Glue is an absolute necessity, some paint, and some table salt. The first thing you want to do is you will just draw your picture with glue. Draw flowers, butterflies, you know, whatever you want. Madeline drew some kind of little, I don't know, abstract art of some sort because, well, she's three. So she's trying her hardest and she is loving it. 
Next, we are going to liberally cover this with some salt. You might want to put this on a tray because we will be dumping the salt back off and you probably don't want it all over your table or your floor. So I do suggest putting this on some type of cookie sheet or something like that. Next, you'll use a very, very wet paintbrush and the color that you're picking and you'll just lightly tap onto the salt and the glue. The salt will actually draw out the color and the water from the paintbrush and it will start to spread it throughout the picture. So if I just touch one part of this with the purple, over the next couple minutes, it will take over a lot of the salt and really blend pretty far. So it's really cool to add a bunch of colors, see how they mix together. You can see how the colors blend to make other colors, but this is kind of what it turns out like. And it was really, really cool and really fun. Madeline loved watching the colors bleed into each other and watching the salt pick up that colored water and just watching it move throughout the picture. So guys, this has been it for our kids craft video today. I hope that you have learned something new and something exciting that you can try with your children. Please let me know if you have any suggestions or if there's a kids craft video that you would like to see. I would absolutely love to do it for you. Please give this video a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.